it's time for another super duper who made the best me in the planet world quiz. That Trump one is actually kind of good, isn't it? <laughs> I'm going to vote for that one today. Why not? Hello, everybody. I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin, and welcome back to Metopia. Who looks like they have the biggest appetite? I'm going to say this guy, Glorglock, whatever his name is. He's a bit strange looking, isn't he? I reckon he's like an animal that has like a second stomach. Some strange alien race. That's going to be a reference from something, isn't it? That's going to be a character from some kind of massive franchise that I've apparently never watched before. So in the last episode, loads of people were commenting saying that I need to make sure that I level up the rest of my party and not just the four people that I currently intend on taking around with me. Because apparently at various different points, it's going to force me to be with certain different allies as well. So um, with our brand new monster armor in tow, we'll make sure that we get back to the rest of the guys and we'll train up a couple of them as well. I don't know what to do. I don't know whether to say like when each of them hits level 13 then swap them out or something like that because obviously Gandalf is now ahead of Love God which is really weird. I feel like Love God should set the bar because he's always in all the fights and then we kind of go from there. I mean is it possible to go without Love God? That's the one thing I don't know. I don't know if I can actually select four different allies and not him. It'd be kind of strange if that was a thing, but I guess we can find out in a moment. But anyway, we need to meet back up with the rest of our party. And I'm anticipating that when they, when we get to the top point, we're then going to have to basically go into spectator mode for a few minutes whilst waiting for everything else. Uh, to make all the monsters do the cleaning, apparently, according to Kenny. That's the only logical explanation. It really isn't, guys. Yeah, it, uh, that's, that's really not the reason why he's taking all the faces. Goddamn. But no, I don't, I don't know if I like the whole spectator mode thing. Really not feeling it. It's a little bit strange. Right, what are we going up against? Ramsey! <gasps> Ramsey's not going to have a face, so what's your face going to be on, mate? Oh, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Oh my word. The Ramsey Demon. So Ramsey's actually a character that a lot of people said that they wouldn't mind seeing get back into the party. So he may well be coming back in a uh, in an episode or so. Uh, let's see. Let's go for Whirlwind Blades and just go for the lot of them. Yeah, that's all right. 20 damage on each of them. Nice. Going for the middle. Good job, Gandalf. What else have we got? Oh, dear. Let's use the safe spot right now, then. Here we go. Kenny's going into there. Let's get a couple sprinkles on old Gandalf. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Right, heal you back up. There we are. Yeah, because I don't know if we'll throw Ramsey back into the mix straight away. A lot of people are saying that they want to see Ramsey and Luffy um, in a party together. So I could see that happening. I think they'd be a good mix. Ooh, close. Right. It's a shame that I don't have an ability to see how much health they've got left. Although I can on the sprinkle screen. So we've got about half on the imps and Ramsey Demon is barely down. I just want to get rid of the demons first because at the minute they are doing way too much damage. Oh, jeez. Hold on a minute. I should have swapped out Kenny ages ago and I haven't done it yet. Oh, come on. There we go. Right, swap you for you. And then might even... Oh, no, because he's going to recover health in there anyway, isn't he? So no need to use the sprinkles. Right, uh, let's go for another whirlwind blade. Let's just try and knock these guys down as quickly as possible. I'll tell you what we've not done yet. We've not used the hyper sprinkles. Should we just go for that? Seeing as this is a boss fight. Here we go. Right, music's picked up. Everyone's hype as anything. Yeah, 58 damage with Kenny on the melee. That's ridiculous. Come on, let's do it. 48 on the damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to burn down the last of this guy. Oh, Royal Escort out of the way. Good, do uh, good job, Dodge. <laughs> Can't speak today. Good Dodge, Kenny. Let's get Danny right the way back up. All right, you ready for this? Keep going, keep going, keep going. Here we go. One more time. You can try your best. What's Kenny going to do? A little bit of assistance. 89 on the assist. Go on, love God. 88 on the attack. This is ridiculous. This is proper nuts. Yeah, they're all caring for each other. Oh, we're getting a little bit low, a couple of us. I want to keep them up just simply because I don't want to lose the hyper. Oh, hold on a minute. Here we go. Nice, good hit. Okay, Ramsey Demon is relatively low. I'm going to make sure that Love God comes right the way back up. I'm going to make sure that Gandalf does, and then we are all out of sprinkles after that. So they're going to have to start using those bananas. Right, hit him with it, Kenny. What you got? Oh, whoa, a large weapon. That should do some good damage. Oh, didn't do as much as I thought it would. Although I guess Kenny didn't hit 52 last time, did he? Wow, triple digits from Love God. Go on, dude. Maybe I should stop using Hyper on the magic users as well. Because when they're just going for those melee attacks. Oh, no, he did use a magic spell. Maybe Gandalf just chose not to on that one turn. Anyway, thank you. Welcome back, Ramsey. Welcome back, dude. Nice. So, yeah, so if we bring Ramsey back, we've basically got fairly decent damage and a healer from that. I 
I don't know who to swap out for him though. Everybody leveling up as well. All oh, the levels. Nice. We got the Devil Protein. Was that triple star rating? Or was it double? And for Tunk. <laughs> Ramsey's back. Hmm. Yeah, welcome back, bro. Here he is. Look at him. You came. Of course we did, mate. Glad you're back to normal as well. I'll fight by your side. But first, I need some kip. All right, Ramsey. Let's get ourselves off to the inn. Oh, he's headed off to the inn. It's interesting that he said that. So does that mean we've still got another encounter before the inn? Oh, maybe. Unless there's going to be a chest. Oh, God, it's this guy. Whoa, well, it's Mr. Beetle. Don't miss this photo op. I'm Beetle, roving photograph extraordinaire. Would you want to buy this picture? Uh, I mean, Danny definitely knew the shot was being taken. Everybody else was just hyped out their face. Let's buy it. Why not? <laughs> He always ends up getting gifted to somebody, doesn't it? Although, having said that, I don't think the last one we bought got gifted. Maybe it will somewhere down the line. Right, Ramsey, who have you not met before, my friend? You've not met Gandalf, so let's throw you into there. Oh, another minute. There we go. Danny can go up there. So, if we wanted to bring Ramsey along for the ride at the moment, who should we drop? Oh, what's going on here? Oh, Gandalf wants to come and see me. Oh, huh, okay. Well, let's put them in the same room. I wonder if he's going to gift us that photo we just bought. Even though I don't think it was him that bought it. I think it was Love God, wasn't it? Let's have a look. Unless I lent it to him. He was like, oh, uh, can I just see that for a second? Decides to gift wrap it and give it back. <laughs> oh, I didn't even see what it said. I skipped through it. I was busy checking that my audio wasn't peaking. God damn it. Keep your eyes on the monitor, Martin. Right. What we got? Gold. Let's go for... Well, that is a lot of money. 1,900 for the full moon frying pan. Yeah, let's have a little look then. So let's look at our team's stats at the moment. I want to see what level Ramsey is currently. So, uh, Ramsey. So Ramsey's level 10. Everybody else is level 12 or 13. So I tell you what. I'm going to swap out Ramsey for Danny. Just because I want Kenny to go up at least one more level. And then obviously Love God can't be changed out, I don't think so. Let's give some people some feed in. We'll probably feed Ramsey, seeing as he's been away for the longest time. Uh, MP and Magic, sure. Let's try and miss some Devil Food Cake. Yeah, look at that, double levels. Uh, Attack and Magic, I'm going to give that to Kenny. Because I reckon you'll benefit from it the most, even if you don't like it. Damn. And then Magic, let's just give it to... I oh, see, Ramsey's Magic's not actually that high. Hmm, interesting. What about Kenny? You use a lot of magic. Yeah, there you go. Level and a half. That's all right. Now, do we want to go into the roulette wheel and see if we can win anything? The arcane one is going to take you up by three and by five, or it can increase Ramsey. I think we probably need to buff Ramsey right now out of anybody. So let's see if we can win it on the roulette wheel. If not, we'll just go straight into rock, paper, scissors. And all we've got to win is one. Oh my God. Okay, hold on a second. Gandalf should be getting an easy weapon here. This should save us like two grand. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Are you kidding me? <laughs> How bad is my look? An MP suite when it's like a, a 90, I want to say, 85% chance of it being the weapon. Are you kidding me? Right, this time for sure. Oh, oh, it's so close. We barely got it that time. Jeez. All right. Well, if it goes at this rate, it should mean that we can buff up both characters, which would be nice. There you go, Gandalf. Even though you're not in the party right now. Oh, you should know you are. You're staying, aren't you? Of course you are. It's Danny we're swapping out. Uh, no, I don't want to play again. Get out of it. Go away. Although that could be... Ooh, just thought. Because we can sell it for the same amount that it costs, can't we? Maybe if we get this money straight away, we'll try and do the uh, the Gandalf thing. Um, Paper. Oh, no. I was going to say, because if we can sell the, the wand for the amount that it costs, we could get a lot of money out of that. Like, more so than the 800 that we win from this encounter. Oh, dude! We're not even going to have it! What do we do? Rock, paper, scissor, or try and get the weapon? I feel like the odds are more in our favour to do the roulette wheel. Because this is one in three, but the weapon is much higher chance. As long as it's still the same. Yeah, it is. Let's go for it. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, perfect. Good, 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 good. Okay, cool. Phew. Should have tried that to begin with, to be honest. Massive face palm on my part. Right, so if we can't get it, we'll sell it for 1,900. Oh, dude. I wish I'd done that with the other tickets. We don't have any more left right now. Damn. And then, obviously, when we leave this place, it's not going to be the same again, is it? Can we afford both of those now? 1,300 and 1,900. Yeah, we can, actually. Damn. 
He's changed over. Actually, no, because we just got Gandalf something, didn't we? Of course we did. No, I'm not buying them two things in one place. You can forget about it. Right, so let's give this a try then. So can you not select Love God? Oh, Love God can't stay. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, well, get rid of Danny, and we'll go like that. I'm going to get basically everybody up to level 13 first, and then we'll go from there. So we've got Kenny and Ramsey that we need to carry a little bit here. I don't think they're going to be massively underpowered. Like, I don't think we're going to get Ruffle Stomp now. So let's see how this plays out. All right. What's going on here? Hmm. I wonder how everyone's doing. All right. Okay, so this is when we're going to do it. Well, we can't just stay hanging about. Let's keep going. All right. See you later, Rick. See you later, Mercy. So now we are controlling these two. Okay. Oh, Guy's there as well. Oh, yeah. I want to visit Rick's room. Oh. It's nice to see Mercy making new friendships. That's awesome. All uh, right. Let's get you up to Rick's room then. There you go. You to have a little chinwag. Hopefully their relationship's just going to spike up to one straight away. They're both singing. Beautiful harmony. Yeah, that's what we wanted. Level two. Showing off. Nice. Right, what we got in the shop then? Mercy wants some new armor. Uh, yes, I will buy that for you. Because I am planning on having Mercy in my main team, so I don't mind buffing her up a little bit. And that gold just completely adds to the whole outfit, so I'm digging it. She's really... We've bought a lot of stuff for her. I feel like we've bought more stuff for her than we have a lot of the other allies. Uh, I think if we bring Guy along, there we go. We can start leveling these guys up to 13 as well. Probably it's going to be a case of Rick and Guy... Oh, no, sorry, Rick and Mercy might not get to level 13 by the time they get up there, unless I go both routes, because it looks like I can go for two chests at the moment, so maybe if I do all of them, we'll get a little bit of XP grinded in there. Right, what's going on here? Oh, no, don't you two fall out. Is she going to stop it? Yes, thank God. Oh, that's good. Why doesn't Mercy get any um, plus relationship from that? Those two are probably, like, on thinner ice than she is. Uh, which way? Let's go left to start with. Oh, this is going hella quick. Is that going to be the inn? Oh, no. It's going to be an encounter. Silly me. Thinks I could walk the corridors of Voldemort's castle without running into something. All right. Might as well just hold this down and just watch them destroy everything. All I can do here is hold B. We're just along for the ride. I'm sure they'll sort themselves out with whatever they need. Can you imagine if I got a game over from this? <laughs> like, I know it's on me to maybe heal them up with sprinkles and stuff, but that'd be mad if it if that happened. Nope, still not down yet. What are you going for? There you go. Good job. Wow. They're going to hit 700 for us as well. Still in one piece. Everybody's good. Butterfly honey to be eaten. And the diamond. Ooh, I thought that was going to be another encounter then. Stop him for a snack. So his mana's back up. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed a bit pointless, but sure. Come on, where is it? There you go. Another choice. Let's just keep going left. We'll basically just keep tackling the left-hand side. And if we rerun this route, we can obviously then go to the right. There you go. Open it up. Yay! Game ticket. Hopefully, we can get that thing for Gandalf again. That'll be another 2k in the bag instantly. Let's have a look. So their friendship's going up a little bit. Ooh, what's going on? Oh, this comes up so, like, frequently. I've only had the game open for 15 minutes, and it's already asking me. Uh, let's have a look. Rick needs some new armor. Don't have the dollar for that, but... Should we have a look at the roulette wheel? It's going to be a different one, probably. Yeah. Silk vestments. Or a generous portion of XP. Mm. Nah, I tell you what. We'll try and get some money. We'll try and get the 800 out of the uh, the old rock, paper, scissors machine. Just going to mash A, and hopefully it's going to be the right one. Here we go. Ready? Nice. Got it. I'm not going to go for it a second time, though. So that'll be fine. Nope, 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 nope. Don't want to play. Do not fancy a bash, sir. 800 in the bag. Takes us up to 1.5k. I don't know if that's still going to be enough. I'm sure the armor was a bit more than that. Oh, no, it was 920. Okay, cool. We're all right. It wasn't even four digits. Yeah, look at that. The woolly lab gear. <laughs> Can I get him in a more slightly blue color? There you go. It closely resembles the color of his eyebrows and his hair. Granted, you can't see either of them, but it's fine. Right, food. Who are we going to feed up? I reckon we're going to feed up Rick, because he likes this stuff. Might even give him another one, just simply because he'll get the most benefit out of it. There you go. Right, so now that we have a choice, which one do we want to follow? They're both going to lead to the same place. I guess if we stick with that decision of always going to the right, then we'll be okay. We can probably rerun the other tracks before the end as well. 
We'll probably have our whole party reassembled by that point, to be honest. Right, here we go. Uh, is there something on me? Well, there's a bug on your clothes. Oh, God! Oh, he panicked a bit too much. Okay, so, note to self, Guy isn't good with bugs. And he will harm anybody that's in his way, regardless of ally or foe. Oh, wow, three game tickets. Nice. Okay, we should definitely go to the right. Maybe we'll just do one at a time. Oh, there's another one that's going to be a baddie. Yeah, thought it was. But we need that XP. Oh, it's just loads of skeletons. <laughs> I really don't like them. Go on, finish them off in one go. Oh, close. There's one down. Go on, guy. Do a song or something. Go on. Nope, just love song. It's just about getting everybody on side. Too cool for that. Ouch. One HP. One HP. And here it comes. Nice. Good finish. And Rick's going to finish him off. Man, he is burning through mana. This guy's a madman. Tell you what, Rick is getting super close to leveling up. He's like maybe one encounter away from leveling. If it's as difficult as that last one. Right, Divine Power. HP sprinkles up to 180. MP up to 60. Ho, ho, ho. All the usual stuff. Next one, it's 750 people. Chop, chop. Ho, ho. <laughs> Character's so weird. Right, let's have a look then. Armor for Rick. Twice in a row. Sure, mate. Why not? I get the feeling he's not going to buy it. Yeah, I didn't think so. The fact he just bought some armor in the last place just made me a little bit skeptical about the whole thing. We've got three game tickets. Let's go into the roulette wheel, see if there's anything good. It's relatively even. I don't think I want to bother with that one just yet. I'm going to leave it for now. We're going to set on out. Oh, I've just realized as well that um, Guy and Rick have zero relationship. That's a shame. Right, let's go to the right. We'll finish off this path and then we'll get ourselves up to the joiner. And then it should be just one more stretch until we're reunited with all of the party, which will be awesome. Oh, chest. It's going to be a monster. Yep. Thought it would be. They tease you with that icon on the world map. And then they do this to you. Right, let's see how these guys fare with these ones. Two banshees. Oh, she's down in one hit. A glitch. Pretty strong. Oh, that's a lot of mana sucked out. Dark Griffin missed his move. That's a pretty good sign for us. Earworm is going to cause, I think, both of them there to dance. Right, all you got to do now is just burn this Griffin down. Nice. I forgot Mercy's got that move. That could come in super handy at a later date, like for some of the larger enemies as well. I genuinely thought Rick could level off that. Because a griffin's pretty strong, right? Or at least, maybe, I, maybe I've just got it in over my head. Maybe I'm like hamming up griffins more than I should do, but they've been the strongest enemies in like the earlier tiers. I just thought that sort of status would carry through. Right, here we go. So many treasure chests. We found it, the treasure room. You snooze, you lose. I'll have this and that and that too. Hey, save some for me. It's all mine. Well, I think I'll just help myself while they're at it. Good stuff. Was that just in reaction to the chest we just opened? Yep, apparently so. I didn't know if we were going to get an extra little notification out the back end of that. Right, we should probably work on your two's relationship. Let's get the cutscene quickly with the present out the way. And then we'll move Rick and Guy into the same room. Present, what's it going to be? Oh, it's a chandelier. Oh my god. It's pretty cool. I guarantee you that the chandelier in the hotel won't change. Be nice if it did, though. Just whilst they're staying there for the night. Oh, no, Guy. <laughs> Guy's getting jealous. The only way to resolve this is to move Rick away from Guy. Oh, sorry, move Rick to Guy away from Mercy. That's the only way I can see of resolving this. Right, that's going to be the star microphone, as expected. We've seen that on the wheel quite a few times now, but it's never been like a high enough chance of getting it where I've decided to go for it. There you go, your little Princess Papichi outfit. Uh, let's have a look at Rick. He wants that lab gear again. We'll try him one more time with it. Yep, he got it. Nice. You always know it's like the guarantee when they stand to the side when they come back in. Uh, what colour? I'm quite digging the yellow, actually. I think the yellow contrasts with the brown nicely. So you don't like Banshee Tears. What about Rick? Eh, he's all right about it. What about bigger Banshee Tears? I wonder if... Nah, I don't know why I bothered with Mercy there. <laughs> I mean, she did, she does magic, but I thought maybe we might have something on the go there. Because sometimes they like one tier of the food, but not the other tiers. It's always a bit weird. Uh, fluffy Omelette, Star Mike, Johnny John Tickets. No, not really bothered about any of those. Like, their relationships, I'm not overly concerned about raising. It's more just their core levels that I want to do. Right, so that should take us to the join, and that should mean that after this route, we should be joined back up with Love God. Let's go, go, go! 
I wonder how much more is left of this castle. It's a shame you can't have a little scroll through the area map, you know what I mean? Uh, pull the lever. Always go for the left one. Yay, banana. Good stuff. Keep on going. Wonder what we're going to encounter next. I'm going to guess two imps and a banshee. Or another ally. Who is it going to be? Thomas! Oh, God. I did not miss Thomas one bit. Did any of you lot? I, I didn't. Not at all. Oh, wow. Study of Thomas. Thomas is now a picture of the Dark Lord. That's, that gives me very mixed feelings. Right, I might have to be on it a little bit with this one. Make sure that I'm using those sprinkles on them. We'll just keep holding down B to speed the encounter up, though, to start with. Oh, damn. Right, let's not let Mercy do that. I'd rather just keep everybody on the offense to start with. Right, here we go. I know she's a healer, but she does know how to do some damage. Nope, you're also getting distracted. Come on, guys. What are you doing? There you go. Definitely make sure the damage dealers are staying up. There you go, right. Only got 100 or so sprinkles left. Go on, go on, go on. Nope, she's gearing up. Ah, oh, you're all getting distracted. Come on! It's just a painting. She's looking elsewhere. Uh-oh. Nice, good dodge. Ooh, almost dinged on the relationship. Cure on guy. I guess that's good. Relationship's gone up. Level 8. Wow, level 8. Jeez. Okay, didn't even need to be in the same room to level up. Nice, glitch isn't too bad. Yeah, these guys really don't have much going on in terms of power, do they? We need Guy to do, like, a couple songs. That'll do some proper damage to him. Oh, Rick, come on now, dude. Whoa, you are hella low. And she's already used heal. Damn. Okay, never mind. We're all good. We're all good. Oh, actually, give him hyper. Forgot about that. Keep forgetting that we've got that. We've got it so recently that it's just... It's just not something that I resort to. Maybe shouldn't have given it to Mercy, but it's fine. I wonder if their hyperness will override the distractions that the picture provides. I reckon it might do, you know. They're so hyper, they're not even taking a moment to study yet. Full heal. Didn't realize you only had 30 HP, Rick. Jeez. It's a bit low. Right, get back to it, you lot. Go on, big attacks. Nice. Keep going. Rick's a little bit low, but it should be okay. Nice, 63. Let's use some sprinkles on Rick now, though. Cool. Got him down to about a third of health left. Go on, go on, go on. Heal him up. Good, right. Get back to it, boys. And go. Go on, go on, go on. Nice, 58. That's good damage. Oh, it's slowed down a bit now. Yeah, look, one of them is out of the hyper. Oh, dear. Yeah, a couple of them are now. Let's get Mercy back up. And the final sprinkle was for Guy. I don't think that'll mean Mercy will try to heal even if she comes out of her hyper. I think she'll go for damage. Yep, thought she might do. Uh, I think we still have some more hyper left. I reckon if we give the hyper to Rick, that'd be a good shout. I think Rick and Guy both hit quite hard when they try to. We'll leave Mercy on the heels. If those two can just basically powerhouse through. And then Mercy can heal them up. Go on. Oh, that's not much of a heal, that. I was expecting a bit more from it. 64 damage and down goes Thomas. The canvas painted. <laughs> I didn't know what I was going to come up with there. I was, I was searching my brain, searching my bank for a pun, but there was none delivered. Right, there we go. Everybody's going to level up off this one for sure. Whoa, actually, I don't know if Guy did. Uh, 3 HP and magic for Rick. He's got 2 speed, 1 attack, defense, and 2 MP as well. Mercy leveling up for 3 HP and magic, 2 speed and MP, 1 attack, and defense. Bonus XP, probably for Guy, because he's the furthest. Oh, actually, no, he's the furthest in front. Uh, it looks like Rick is going to get it then. Nice. Art biscuit. Very rare. Man. So is that everybody back in the party now? So we've got these three, and now a fourth one. And then we've got all of our guys. I think we're still missing Luffy. And we're still missing... I'm sure there's another person we're missing. Luffy and who? Oh, I can't remember now. No, maybe we do have everybody. Because it's nine allies total, isn't it? Or nine characters. Oh, God, it's Beetle. Let's look at the picture. That's actually a really nice picture. I like that. I'm digging it. Cool. Right, get yourself to the inn. And hopefully we can meet up with everybody. Oh, yeah, moving Thomas into a room. Has Thomas ever met Mercy? I don't think so. There you go. Actually, has Thomas met any of these characters before? Because that, that top screen looks super empty just then. Let me have a quick look. I don't think he's ever met a single one of these people. 
Let's have a look. Thomas. Yeah, Thomas has never met any of these lot. That's mad, isn't it? That's crazy. Uh, Thomas wants some new armor. I, don't, I really don't want to buy stuff for him. I really don't like him. <laughs> I know that sounds really harsh, but I just don't. Not one bit. Weaponry, silver shell. So that would be for Thomas. If we're not going to buy him something, let's just look out on something. Oh, yeah, it's going to land in it. Good job. Okay. That's probably going to save us quite a bit of money, to be fair. Don't know how much, but it'll be fair whack. There we go. Thomas, equip yourself, mate. Tell you what, it took him up by like seven damage. It's pretty good. The Art Biscuit. HP and MP for who? Mm, maybe for Rick? Yeah, he likes that enough. Didn't take up much of his hunger, though. I guess it was a teeny tiny biscuit, but it had big effects. Right, here we go. Full team of four. He's only level 11. Damn. Okay. I wonder what level you get to by the end of the game. I wonder if it's like as high as 20s and 30s. I mean, we've got a long way to go still. Yep, look, there we are. Everybody's back together. Wait, look! Yay! Hey, Rick! Everybody's back together. The team was reunited. Good stuff. They picked up a friend along the way, just like we did. Right, so how many allies we got now? So that's... Yeah, we're still missing one. We're just It's just Luffy left. Man, that sucks. Of all the characters we wanted back, he was one of the ones we wanted back soonest. Uh, so you've actually never met Thomas before, Rick. So I'm going to move you into there. Gandalf has never met Ramsey before. But then have Ramsey and Kenny ever met before? I don't know if they have. Let's have a quick look. Let me check on Ramsey. Where is he? Oh, yeah, Ramsey and Kenny have ne never met before. Love God has met everybody. Uh, so, if anything, we want to move Guy and Gandalf together and work on all the other relationships. God, this is, man, this is all getting a bit too much now, isn't it? <laughs> We've got far too many allies. Right, what does Danny want? 1,300 for that. Mm, I could try and win you some. Let's have a little look on the roulette wheel first. See if I can win something for you. A blade fan. That would be for Kenny, wouldn't it? And there's a very high chance of getting it, so... Might as well give it a crack. Unless I already have that weapon. A little part of me feels like we might already have it. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Yeah, we're good. Oh, that was close. Two off of getting the food. And it was only a mo- Oh, no, it was, it was XP. A morsel of XP. Right, so does Kenny already have it or not? Oh, no, it's an upgrade. Cool. That's a lot of damage, actually. Six up on that. I think it was five up on this magic. So now that we're reunited with almost all of our allies, bar one, I think that's a nice place to leave it for today. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. In the next episode, we're going to continue through the Dark Lord's castle and try and find Luffy. Ta-ra.